Okay, tutorial four is using the rectangular marquee tool. I'm going to go and open a new document, 8 by 10 at 300. And this is a way of selecting different things and bringing them into your collage. So the rectangular marquee is here, the second tool on your toolbox. And there are more underneath that we're going to explore. So make sure that it's selected. And anywhere on the page, I can basically select anything that's square or rectangular. Use the Move tool, and I'm basically cutting and pasting it out of the original document. I'll grab another picture just to show you. Remember to zoom in is Command Plus. So get my rectangular marquee tool, get to the corner. Once I've got it selected, grab the Move tool, bring it over, go back to my image, grab a window this time. And I'm basically just cutting and pasting into my new document. And that is the rectangular marquee tool. Okay, tutorial five is the elliptical marquee tool. I'm gonna go File, New, 8 by 10, 300, say OK. And this is a great tool for cutting out things that are circular. So it's actually located under the rectangular marquee tool, the second one down on the toolbox there. And once I've selected it, the rectangle, sorry, the marquee tool is a little bit trickier, the elliptical, um, in that it's harder to um, keep it in the spot that you need it. So I'm going to start in the far upper corner. I'm going to click and drag. And so I've got my circle happening, but it's kind of traveled off that one left edge. So I'm going to hold down the spacebar tool, sorry, the spacebar with my finger on the keyboard, and I'm going to drag it back. And it knows that that stops it from expanding in size. And when I let go of the space bar on the keyboard, I can keep making it bigger and then hold it back on the space bar, realign it to that upper left hand corner, and then reposition finger off the space bar and completely finish dragging it and getting my shape. Now it's a little high there, so I'm going to space bar and just realign it, maybe make it a tiny bit smaller. Okay, once I'm happy with that, just get my move tool and bring it into my composition. And do that one more time. Let's do it with a bowling ball here. So again, selecting my tool, starting in the one corner. Once I sort of have it the right close enough to the size, I'm going to use the space bar to realign it. Let go of the space bar, keep pulling back. And then once I'm happy with my selection, let go, get my move tool, and bring over my bowling ball. And that's the elliptical marquee tool.